guys, it is a new day. I just made it into the office and I have a bunch of packages that came. Um, one of them being this heavy ass one that I just carried in here. And those things against the wall, which is my flooring. Yes, because this flat ass, whatever color, charcoal color carpet is not gonna work for me. Look at this, let me show you. So the carpet is just charcoal and I plan to be doing hair in here, like wigs colored and like sometimes there's bleach involved and I just want my full deposit back. So I got some renter friendly flooring that we will be putting down probably today. I'm not sure. Um, I hope today because then we could really begin being. Still have to get wallpaper but everything else is here. So basically I'm going to organize everything. Probably going to set the, the thing up first because this right here is supposed to go in this window seal. And once I have that set up, I'll have places to put things. See where I'm going? So I should do that first. The only thing that makes me not want to do it first is the flooring because I'm going to have to move it out the way. So would I rather move it out the way compact and small or would it be easier to just slide out if it's built? Cause you know, weight distribution and things like that. But uh, let me at least look at the floor and see how easy it's going to be. It's literally just peel and stick. <laughs> so. I'm assuming I'm just putting down like a hundred stickers that are six by 36. So we gonna see, um, here's what it looks like. I don't know why there's two boxes that's two different sizes because I ordered the same goddamn thing. It's crooked, I'm sorry. Is that better? No. Ugh. Being a Virgo sometimes it's like, bro, leave me alone. <laughs> leave me alone. Damn, I ain't got no damn scissors. It's bending. Do I have scissors? Do I have scissors? Do I have scissors? No. No. Ooh. Yes. I'm so freaking smart. I, I've had this for years. Years. Never opened it. Never used it. But something just told me look in the box. And I got some little mini scissors. All right. So I should get you guys a better angle, huh? Let me uh, do this, this, that, yes. Also just got this out the garage. Everything's gonna need to be dusted and moved out the way, so. Now we can slide that out of the way. I will leave all my office stuff linked below because this is an office suite, which means uh, everything I have better be renter friendly because I'm trying to get my full deposit back if I ever leave, so yeah. See, I literally bought a freaking floor. What the heck? Who's buying floors out here for the office suite? Probably a lot of people. <laughs> Don't mind me. Wow, it looks so good. It's exactly what I thought it would look like. So apparently I'm supposed to just be able to Oh yeah, that's renter friendly. It ain't even that damn sticky. And this carpet is like the flattest, like no nothing carpet. Like it's, there's no mush, there's no cushion, there's no, like it's literally just like, like it's, I don't know. So, ah, it seems like it's gonna be so easy. I gotta set you guys up right. So that we can do this right. Cause I've never done this before. I've just walked on hardwood floors before. These are vinyl wood looking for so look my thing is i'm thinking i just trim the wall first and then brick lay that so the next one in the next line i have to cut in half and and just keep going and keep going and keep going so if it's 54 square feet per pack i bought two packs because i think mine is 100 something but my thing is why do i got two different boxes uh, two different sizes. I mean, I know I ordered two packs, but see how much bigger this box is? I'm confused. Damn, I need some cheap ass scissors. They already bent from cutting tape. Wow. Okay. 
um, oh, <laughs> they done. They put a box in a box. I don't know why. If you're gonna put this one outside the box, you should have just saved the plant and not use extra material. I need a box cutter. different kinds and these are the ways that you can lay them oh that's cute should I get should I get a chevron pattern hold on whoops oh I can lay them this is the way I was talking about laying them basically doing the edge first and then cutting it so that it's staggered but oh no this is the way I was talking about brick layer and then there's this, and I'm like, ooh, but I ain't got the patience. So I'm gonna just do it this way, but it's gonna be the long way. Hey, yay, I'm so happy. Pretty easy, pretty straightforward, you know? Yeah. All right, we need to get started. I also got this for my like memory cards, all my extra cores, my batteries, you know, what's that shit called? All the stuff to keep it safe and dust free. My hard drive, that's what I was trying to say. My hard drive and all the connects and things. All right, I'm gonna begin and place the first one. I'm so scared. kind of hard to like get it up against the wall but I did do it so yeah and then this side it's like a gap but if I slide it up there then there's gonna be a gap right here and that's against the wall that's against the wall I don't know is that gonna be obvious whatever so I got this much far, uh, still got more to go. So I will check in when we're good. From the heathens, got will, got fight, got pride, got reason. If they wanna go eat, then you know I'm gon' feed them. If you're coming for me, you ready for a demon? I got eyes in the back of my head, I'm seeing. Take me for granted, and you know I'm leaving. I'ma take what's mine with the webs I'm weaving. I could take this crap from seeing to believing. Got a taste for blood, and my tongue keeps bleeding. From the words I spit, so sharp, so freezing. So cold, behold, I fight, they feeling. You a pop for rock and roll freedom Don't believe in faith, don't believe in ceilings I just need a taste till my mind starts feeling I don't pace myself, I grind on kneeling Got lust for change, I just love the feeling uh. I ain't gonna give up Got too little time, I'ma live up Head down, push forward through the tough times Cause anything worth doing is a tough climb I'm 
Okay, so I finished with one box. We got one box left and I'm pretty sure I ordered enough. Might even have leftovers. So let me show you what one box did. Hold on. So we have, hold on, let me put it on wide angle, but this is what we have. So far so good. This is all I have left. And I was able to do that. I got, I messed up, but luckily this corner is where the furniture will be that I have to build next. But yeah, half the room is done. Now we just gotta do that side. Yay. And here is with the wide angle lens. So I got, oh, maybe I won't have enough. Is that half? I don't know. Is that half of that? It looks like, well, keep in mind there's a dark panel. So is that half? Maybe. We gonna see, hopefully I have enough. If not, it wasn't that expensive, and I think I could order a box with lesser quantity. So I'll check back in when I'm done. You guys, I finished. Oh my gosh. It looks so much brighter in here. It looks wider for some reason. I don't know what the light does, but wow. Oh my gosh. I am so satisfied. Only thing is. <laughs> And then look, there's no like, I can't get it all the way across. But did you notice that before I said something? Doesn't it look like, luckily the molding is like dark. So it, like to your peripheral vision, it kind of blends in and it's along the edge. Now for this, I was thinking of either buying one tester and then just cut it up right at the door or say fuck it and just get a nice mat. I'm leaning towards the mat. I think Dollar Tree got some mats. Like, imagine it says, like, something, you know? Anyways, wow, we did it, Joe. It looks so good. Now I just got to build that and put that right there. And then stuff can start going in the cubby holes. Oh, my God. I'm so happy. Wow. Next is this motherfucking blue wall. It's pissing me off. But at least the blue wall looks a lot brighter, right? Isn't that insane what a white floor could do? It just leveled up this whole freaking office space. I don't know, but to me, it looks different. And I feel like that's not as noticeable. And like, whatever. <laughs> it looks so good. I'm so happy with my purchase. I will definitely leave this below, you guys. The fact that I did this on top of carpet is literally insane. And it feels like nice to the touch. It feels sturdy. Now I can color wigs and not worry about bleaching their carpet, fucking up their carpet, getting hair in their carpet. I could just sweep, swiffer, call it a day. Yes, now it's time to build that. But I am hungry, so I'm wondering if I should go get lunch or just go ham and, and I'm gonna go ham. Let's go ham. All right, I'll be, let me see what this is giving. When I was measuring stuff, like these floors, I literally was just cutting it with regular cheap ass, janky ass um, scissors. And I found that if you fold it in half, it will crack for you, which made my janky ass scissors a little bit easier to use. And I just had to cut through the like vinyl stuff. So pretty good trick if you end up getting this and you're like, oh my God. But in hindsight, I would have either gotten fabric, like real good fabric scissors, or one of those like, remember those things in school where you slide the paper and you get a clean line? I would've got one of those. Or I'd just call it in, get like a ruler and a really good Zacto knife. Or a box cutter, like a really good box cutter and a ruler so you can get really straight lines. I used janky curved scissors 
and still was able to get their job done. So as long as you don't look too close, you can't tell. And voila, I finished it. It looks so good. And it even like charges your phone. You can put a USB. You can change the color of the light, turn it off. So that's blue. I guess it comes in three colors. A warmer and then a cooler. And I don't know if you need a special phone to charge, but let me test it out and see. Oh, really? Is that a thing? Oh, um, they made it seem like I could peel that off. Can I? Anyways, let me see if I can charge my phone, hold on. Oh my God, I literally figured it out, it's a charge button. What? That's so tight, I can charge my phone without even plugging it in. I never been one of those people, but wow, it looks so good. Only thing is I need a longer extension cord, but isn't that nice? Oh my God, honey. And I can even um, screw these, I mean unscrew them if I want to make it taller. But I, I, want, I like it like this because when I put stuff out like on it, I'll still have like peaks of my window view, you know, so. Yay, I'm starving. I did not realize it was six o'clock. I just built that and uh, been in here for hours and hours and hours. Built that, built that. Oh shoot, I need to take the stickers off. But I need to go get some food, so I'm probably just gonna go home for the day. I'm gonna clean up. I didn't realize it was 6.30. I mean, I could stay, but I'm starving, so it's dinner time, and I don't want my boyfriend to have to eat dinner by himself. So I'm gonna go home after I clean up, and then, yeah. Okay, so I'm done for the day. I just need to get a mat for that and or one strip. However, I did have this piece left because I needed to like cut this. See how jank it is, but like far away, you can't even tell. So like, yeah, looking good, looking good, looking good, good. I'm gonna wipe that down because it's kind of dirty. Got the Clorox wipes. I'm also gonna wipe down all my makeup stuff. And then finally, we will do the PR Kiss unboxing video. I just, as you can see, was moving in, <laughs> but all that needs to be washed and wiped down. And these need to be hung up and I still need to get wallpaper. Once that's done, we're done done, you know? So at least now it's filmable and workable. I can make wigs in here and do all the things with my sewing machine, which I still need to bring. But yeah, so I am done for the day. Not really done, just I'll be back tomorrow. Um, yeah, it's so much brighter in here. What the hell, it's, it's like amazing. I don't know where I'm gonna put everything, but it's, it's giving for me. And this is exactly what the doctor ordered. So I'm gonna go eat some Din Din. Turns out my boyfriend, I just texted him what, what the stuff looked like. And it turns out he already had made him a sandwich. He said he just got back in from a walk and now he's eating a sandwich. So I'm actually just gonna go get some food. I don't know if I wanna get Dave's hot chicken or some bomb ass Chipotle. Cause every time I get Chipotle, I basically could eat it twice cause I don't never finish it. So I just sit outside. Oh my God, I'm leaving the office. This is crazy. When I come back, I'll bring my mat, my new mat for that little spot over there. But yep, we're leaving the office. That was episode whatever. I decided I'm trying to get into an office series. So I love you guys so much and I will see you tomorrow. Yeah, I love you. Waiting for the elevator. The elevator is here.